What's going on folks? Welcome back to another episode of Michigan Great Outdoors. I am your host, Jason Strowski, aka The Polak. Today we are going to look at the TX5 suspension system for any mobile hunting tree stand in the market. Let's get stuck in. TX5 suspension system for tree stands. You know, I'm a big fan of TX5. I found them, you know, along my mobile hunting journey and I started with their saddles. You know, I have a Lone Star, I have a Minimalist and Matthew Tompkins from TX5, he just keeps coming out with new products. You know, he came out with the, the Kiss Pack, which I actually have one here. I'm gonna be working on that this weekend, doing a review on that pack. And now he's gone from building the, the saddle mobile hunting pack into an actual tree stand, you know, suspension system. So if guys, you know, maybe they have a, a Novix Hilo or they have, you know, a, a particular stand that doesn't come with a system. Now there's more options out there. Looking at this one, you know, I'll be honest with you. When I opened up the package after I ordered this thing, it came in, I opened it up and it literally looked, I thought it was a Kafaru product. You know, just looking at the, the colors here, this is the Ranger Green. Looking at the, the quality and the stitching, I, you know, I've been buying some Kafaru products lately and I was kind of surprised. Like it really kind of threw me back and I was like, wow, you know, he is really, you know, doing some cool stuff. So this is the suspension kit. It is the full kit, which is $135. Now you might say, well, that's a lot of money for, uh, uh, you know, shoulder straps for a tree stand you know this is kind of tailor made to that upper echelon of you know mobile hunter so maybe you're hunting in hill country you might have to pack a deer out you might be walking two three miles in and you really need some heavy duty straps with a heavy duty waist strap now this also is the full kit which comes with the back pad here as well so i kind of compare this to the Kuyu suspension system, which I think is like 165 bucks. I think maybe you can get it on sale for cheaper, but this is kind of at that upper level. You know, this is for guys that, you know, they want the ultimate in comfort and it's gonna cost a little bit more money. Now you can buy this system individually. And I think individually each component right, is right around 48 bucks. So for me personally, I don't usually run, you know, the, the suspension, you know, waste system. I don't usually need that where I hunt. I hunt a lot of swampland. I hunt a lot of, you know, hardwoods, points, things like that. So for me, if I was gonna go with something, maybe I might just order, you know, the shoulder straps, 48 bucks. Now, if I'm gonna do some, you know, say Southern Ohio this October, I might be going down there. You know, I would probably want the full kit. So I'd want the back pad, I'd want the waist strap. If I shoot a deer down there, I'm probably gonna have to, you know, quarter it out. You're going up and down those hills. There's no dragon deer. You need a system that's gonna be robust, that's gonna be heavy duty, built to last. And you can be rest assured that TX5 has done that on this product here. So looking at the actual system, when I opened it up, like I said, I was blown away by the, the way it looked and the quality of everything, all the stitching. And I was surprised at how easy it was to install. So this is a Lone Wolf Custom Gear 0.75. So it's very simple to put on. You just girth hitch anywhere on the stand. You use this to girth hitch. And then this is the slick clicks that everybody seems to be using right now. They're supposedly very robust. They hold up very well and they're very heavy duty. Those just clip in and then you just have like a tri-glide here. So it's very simple. You just put the tri-glide on, you get the system kind of positioned how you like it. And that's it. It took me less than, you know, probably five to 10 minutes to install it and I was able to tweak it just how I liked it. One of the really awesome features about this, and if you look here, the way I have this on, there is nothing here where your feet are gonna be. The only spot where your feet would touch is right here on the edge, and it's not in the way at all. It's perfectly silent, there's no issues with it, and it really does fit this stand pretty, pretty perfectly. I'm trying to just show some uh, field clips, field clips, clips from the field, TX5 suspension, it's pretty nice man, I got my steel head on, 
I love this thing so I can put all my junk here and I don't have to try to dig behind me but yeah I mean it's solid I got a heavy load on today too I mean I got more shit than I normally have to be honest probably at least a 30 pound load no problems at all you can cinch it up nice and tight sternum straps good it's a solid option man I really I really dig it and um, I had a problem I had the, the long post on this stand and the post was digging in my back but I put that you can't see it that TX5 pad on the back of my stand and it doesn't do it anymore so that's cool <laughs> So looking at the actual product here, it's made from 500D Cordura and it's called Spacer Mesh is what is installed here on the back side. It's very nice. There's some sort of foam inside. This is all made in the USA and it's all sourced USA components. So you can, you know, you look at the price and you go, man, you know, it's a kind of expensive, you know. There's not a lot of people that are making this stuff in the USA. So you got to give your hats off to, you know, TX5. They're, they're keeping it in America. They're making, using USA components. So it's going to cost a little bit more. One of the really cool features about this is there is a ton of adjustment here in the sternum strap. I always tend to find, maybe it's because of my shoulders and, you know, I'm a big, bigger, broad guy that my sternum strap, I just can't get it down far enough. So in this one here, there was no issue at all. There's like, there's probably 10 inches of adjustment here. The waistband feels really good. You get it right on top of your hips, feels great. Very good biting clip here, no issues. And it's very easy to adjust and lock down. I was talking with TX5, he is going to offer this with two sizes of waistbands. He's gonna have a medium, which is gonna basically hit up to 36 inch waist and then anything over 36 is going to be a large and i'm a 38 and this is i mean i had a ton of room left over so you'll be able to wear this uh, on a large size even if you had like a 42 waist or maybe even like a 44 something like that so you can see i chose ranger green for my color i'm a big ranger green guy he does offer it in four different colors you can get it ranger green you can get it multicam wolf gray and coyote so four different flavors kind of customize your setup you can get something kind of unique and yeah i think it's a great system you know maybe if i'm hunting down here in michigan in the swamps i'll probably take this off you know it's very easy to just pop this off here and same thing on the bottom pull it off and if i want to you know hunt down in the hills of kentucky or something like that i can put it back on now you're also able to remove the waistband it's velcro strapped in here so if you just undo that you can pull this out and remove the waistband if you don't want it if you just want you know the back pad and the shoulder straps you're able to do that so if you say if you just want to buy you know this kit with just shoulder straps and the back pad here it's going to be a little bit of savings obviously so overall it's a simple product, but it's important. You got to make sure that you can haul your stand out in the woods effectively and you can choose what you want. Made in America, TX5, very happy with this product and I'm excited to run it. I have it on the 0.75 here. I don't know if I'm going to keep it on this one or maybe I'll put it on my Novix Hilo or something like that, depending on what I'm hunting for that situation. So quick little review. Hopefully it's uh, helpful for you. If you like videos like this, Please consider subscribing, hit that thumbs up button. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.